We are on day number 13. I've been away all day in two vegan and uh, fixing some papers and had a good lunch and uh, and then uh, some uh, uh, lunch yeah, and we buy some different things. I have some tools to show you which I also buy, <laughs> bought and I'm always happy when I buy tools. But when I came back then two hours before work ended I was really irritated and I'm still is but we had a meeting now and I really got out all my frustrations uh, and uh, that is about this one this is the tie beams which we poured yesterday down here in the caretaker house that was finished noon yesterday and I said to the workers that or I said to the foreman actually that we leave this for six days, no more work down here. And when I come back today, what do I see? They have removed all the forms because they want it to dry more quick. That is a really opposite to what you should do with concrete. You should try to keep the moist in as long as possible. And, uh, and also one reason why I said they should not do anything down here is that because the form was here right it goes up here and then we're going to pour the floor on top of this like 10 centimeters thick so what we what my plan was was just to take the form which went down here we just move it up 10 centimeters and we have all the, the outer form finished they, they were finished because they were in place so it's very easy to move them up but now they take away everything split everything so we need to make new forms and everything and I'm really what you call sour it's frustrating really frustrating sometimes huh? so but we had uh, a meeting upstairs now and I really said my and and I really made it clear that I'm the one who's judge the foreman is number two and all the other ones they talk to the foreman before they do something that is important. <sighs> Sometimes it's super frustrating here in the Philippines. Really is. But okay. Uh, it looks like they had some, uh, uh, not some, but uh, actually a lot of progress. They dug this hole and that is, I don't know, almost finished. And this one is almost finished. And we have three holes, so one, two, three, four, five. And we had, starting with two here. And that is a double column, actually. Uh, so, yeah, they made progress today. Even if I was not here, made too much progress downstairs. Uh, now it's 5.30 and uh, Don Don is ready to go home and all the workers uh, have gone. I kept them a little bit longer and I said nobody leaves this place before five o'clock because normally they go five to ten minutes early. But okay, uh, I bought me some tools. I uh, bought me another, another grinder on battery with a four amp battery and uh, the name is Wadfo, but it's same as Inco and a lot of other brands. They're all the same. And then we bought this one. This is for cutting the grass. It's actually also on battery. And then as a present, since I bought so much, I got a free uh, drill, small drill. So <laughs> yeah, so uh, not so bad. And the price, uh, 2,800 peso for this one. It's a grass trimmer on battery um, that is in Norwegian Kroner 560 and this one was 4000 so that is uh, 810 Kroner and then the other one was free uh, yeah and we got uh, all the delivery of the sand and the gravel I think uh, at least we got the, uh, the note, so we need to go there and pay them tomorrow. But we got five loads of sand and only three of three-fourth gravel, but um, I think that is wrong. But it doesn't matter, we're going to use it uh, all of it anyway, so 
and we just order more so it's no problem yeah that's uh, <laughs> that's about it on a frustrating uh, day 13 and today is wednesday the 8th of uh, november i think but um, i show you the view here a little bit now when the sun has gone down this is uh, where the sun is sun is going down there and you see the sky is getting nice and clear yeah and they made a lot of footers also today then so okay fresh start tomorrow i said what i mean what i meant so let's go home in our ford ranger Thank you, that is all for day number 13.